put some seeds over here, oil, butter, and stuff. Man, this place is ginormous. You can go crazy up in this joint. Yeah, dude, we could play real life Call of Duty in here. It's not many uh, places to hide, but you know, it'd be fun nonetheless. Yeah, I'm not real good at getting shot, bruh. So uh, you won't see me playing that game because I'd probably get killed. Well. We'll see about that one day, won't we? Wait, what do you mean by that? Really guys, this, are you done? Is it a good conversation? You do realize we're trying to open a theater right now, right? Like I could use a little bit of help. Mm. Yeah. Rob, I'm sorry. how much do you really think we can get done here with so few of us? I mean, take a look around. We're not exactly home extreme makeover. Well, I mean, I guess you're right on that. I guess it wouldn't hurt to hire a few more people. <laughs> Christy, Wayne, did you, did you hear anything I said? About what? What do you mean about what? I need you to like go out. I like, we need to get people on. I need you to like go out and round up anybody you can in town that like will work for practically nothing. Yay, okay. Well, I was getting bored here anyway, so. Wayne, I need you to go with her. Just keep an eye on her, okay? Yes, master. Still with the master, really? Yes, master. All right, uh, Derek, I got, you can help me with interviews. I'll probably need a second opinion. Yes, I was hoping you'd pick me, because I, you know, I really like judging people. What about us? What do you want? Yes. Well, I guess you three, you go out. Um, we're going to need, like, seeds, butter, you know, all the concession stuff. I'm going to let y'all do that, I guess. Mm -hmm. okay. uh, I guess we could do that. There is a lot of stuff to get. I mean, if you guys can't handle it, I got a list. It could oh, work. Nope. Had a we list. can do this. Well, I can at least. Uh, how are we going to pay for all this? I guess you can take the company card. Be careful with that, though. I'm not messing around. Rob, when have we ever let you down? Well, I can think of at least like 10 times you guys would let me down. Doesn't matter. We got this. Yeah. Come we'll on. See you later, Rob. All right. You back soon. See you later. Hello. What are you guys doing back already? You're supposed to be finding potential new employees. Hmm. Actually, we did. There is a lot of people outside right now. There's no way is that many people excited about working at this crappy movie theater. Okay, well, I may have told them that this was an audition for a role in a movie and not a job at a crappy theater, but it seemed to have worked really well. Wayne, like, I just asked you to keep an eye on her. Like, is that hard? What happened to that? I did, but she got the popcorn instead. You know what, Christy, just go buy us some time, set up, do whichever you can. We're just gonna have to wing it, I guess. I don't know, Derek, let's go, let's just go. Oh wait, hold on. Hey Wayne, give me some of that popcorn. No, it's not! Get away! Jeez, Wayne, if you love popcorn that much, why don't you go ahead and marry the damn popcorn? Come on, Eric. All right, according to the list, we need popcorn bags, cups, a microwave. Why the hell do we need a microwave? For the microwavable popcorn. Rob said we're keeping it cheap. Ooh, Wayne is not going to be happy about that. That dude is always manifesting popcorn from somewhere. I'm sure he'll be fine. Yeah, where does he get it from? Does he have like a popcorn farm or something? <laughs> Wait a minute, Danny. You do realize popcorn farms, they're not really a thing, right? Uh, sure they are. There are corn farms and from corn comes popcorn. He's got you there. But, Daddy could be onto something here. We could start a popcorn farm, sell it to all the movie theaters, 
make a ton of profit. We'd probably get richer doing that than working at Cinema Prime. I mean, with Let's... that though comes actual work. I mean, I don't want to work on a farm, do you? Uh, look, Danny, pull over. Pull over. Get, All right. Pull okay, here. over. All right, here's the spot. All right. I will be right back. Jeez. Dude, what the hell was that about? I don't know. Riley scares me sometimes. Yeah, me too. Just stay on our good side and you'll be all right. Sorry about that. The line was incredibly long and I had problems with the card. Um, and what is that? Uh, it's a fog machine. I saw a sign for one on sale back there, so I decided we probably needed it for the theater. And I, I, I'm sorry, but why do we need a smoke machine for the theater? For my badass interests to work every day, of course. But that wasn't on the list, was it? There were a lot of things that weren't on the list, Danny, that we totally needed. Of course we need the things that are on the list, but that's why Rob sent us. Well, in that case, I've got a couple of ideas. I mean, I guess a few extra things wouldn't hurt. No, that is the spirit, Danny. Onward, noble steed! Hey, I just want to say I appreciate the opportunity for such a large role. I think you're misinformed. This, this is for a job at a movie theater. It's, it's not an audition, it's an interview. Are you serious? I didn't pick my kid up from school. I've made a huge mistake. I've gotta go pick her up. What have I done? His kid is doomed. Should we call child services? Nah, we don't have time for that. Hello, I'm Lando Quackenbush, and I'll be auditioning for the role of Dustin. Role? There's no movie role here, but if you're interested in working at a movie theater, we have some opportunities for you. So wait, there's no role? Damn, I really went all out for this audition. Uh, now, now I see why you're wearing the gloves and, and roller skates. Yeah, you actor types are weird, man. What, these? I always wear these. Do you know how many germs are on a single pencil? Oh, you really want us to answer that? No, I don't. 5.2 Legillion. I'm pretty sure that's not a number, but what about those skates, bro? They help protect me from my biggest adversary, the floor. Well, yeah, uh, I think you're weird, but weird seems to fit in around here, so you, you want a job? Well, I can't seem to get a gig in this town elsewhere, so why not? Do y'all supply rubber gloves, or do we have to supply our own? Rubber gloves? We don't wear gloves here. Hello, I am Ashley Jones. And I am Ashley Bones. And, and together, together, we, we are, are the Ashleys. Ashleys. We are hard workers, we are quick learners, and our dream is to be the best bouncers in a movie role ever. Ever. There's no role, there's no movie. This is for a job at a movie theater. You were misinformed. Thank you, have a nice day. Wait, there's no role for a movie? My mom is gonna be so upset. Okay, tell your mom you'll get the next one. You don't know my mom, I just wanna make her proud. <laughs> Suck it up, don't be a little bitch. Hey, what about being actual bouncers? You guys could actually be security for us. They, they could? Yeah, sure. I guess we can do that. Nothing bad will happen on our watch. We will. This is perfect research for the role. We're going to be the best damn bouncers after this. And you can make your mom happy. Okay, we will. Uh, can I wear my pink bandana? It's my absolute fave. Yeah, whatever. I don't care anymore. You're, you're both hot. Woo! You! You 
Rob. What's up? What do you think about uh, doing the rest of the interviews by yourself? Why, you got, you got somewhere to be? Uh, I'm having stomach problems, bro. Ooh, yeah, you might want to take care of that. Thing. Yeah, I got to take a huge dump, man. So that'd be awesome if you could do this for me. Yeah, uh, yeah, I think I can handle it. Oh, God. Be careful. <laughs> Hi, my name's Wayne Livid. I'm here for my interview. Wayne, what are you doing? I've always wanted to work at a movie theater. Were you, were you dropped on your head as a child? You, you don't need an interview. You're already hired. I got the job? Fine. Uh, yeah, you can start tomorrow, okay? Yes! Thank you. I won't let you down, master. Greetings. I'm here for my interview for a job that you're going to hire me for. No, 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 no. I cannot have your type of crazy in here. You're going to scare away all the customers with your weird time and space theories or whatever you talk about. They're not theories. They're fact. That's okay. That's okay. I don't blame you for not understanding. The ability to travel through points in time hasn't been invented yet, so... Can't blame you. Whatever. Uh, case closed. I obviously can't hire you. Please change your mind. I, I really do need this job. Well, you know, I guess you could be the janitor, but I don't want to see you talking to customers at all or you're fired. See? I told you you were going to hire me for this job. Time wizard from the Megaplex? Uh, yeah, I think you're right. Oh my god, what's he doing here? Yeah, I hope we didn't hire him. Actually, we did. But only as the janitor. <laughs> Still a terrible idea. What, it, what is all this stuff? Like, I, I asked y'all to get, like, simple things. You got a pool noodle, like a, pool, a Christmas tree. What? Why is there a Christmas tree? Well, there were a lot of things that weren't on the list. Like, a fog machine. Yeah, uh, we don't need a fog machine. It's a movie theater. Like, come on. Well, it could have been worse. I mean, we we're gonna get a lot more stuff, but then the card stopped working. It kept on saying deck lined. I don't know what that means, but yeah, there's nothing more we could do about it. You mean like declined? Like we're out of money? Like this is a good, we're doomed? I mean, y'all just need to get simple stuff. Now we have nothing. Well, I, I got us some uniforms. Oh, you well. know. Those, those are kind of cool, I guess. Hmm. Be careful with those, though. They were $75 a pop. $75 for a t-shirt? Nice t-shirts. They're not that nice. $75, that's way too much. That was all your money right there. All the money? What do you mean, all the money? All the money on the card that you got declined. Declined, if you said. I mean, you could use another corporate card. There are, there's no other cards. I spent all the rest of the money on the rent this month. Are you serious? You trusted them with the cards? Seriously? Well, I mean, yeah, I kind of had to. I didn't have a choice, but we got to get like the chairs together and the projector going. We got to get, we got to open tomorrow. Oh, the projector. That's what we forgot. You forgot the projector? Like wow. in the chairs? We need all that. We're trying to open like tomorrow. Wait, what do you mean we're opening tomorrow? Well, I was going to surprise you guys. I put like a ad in the local paper saying we're going to open our brand new luxury theater tomorrow. Far from luxury, dude. Well, it, it could have been if you didn't go spend all the money on stupid stuff, but now we're going to have to try to do something. I guess I'm going to go home and get my flat screen from the house. And I guess, I don't know, try to find some chairs. I don't know, like whatever you can find, I guess. We are opening Cinema Prime tomorrow. More like Cinema Lame. Too soon, man. Too soon. Suck 
shut up. Don't be a little bitch. <laughs> Tell your mom you'll get the next one. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm Danny. Just wanted to welcome you guys to the team or well, whatever you want to call this group of misfits. Has he been cleared yet? I don't know, I haven't had him down. We definitely need to give him a pat down. Alright man, you have to turn around and spread your legs. Whoa. Rob! Robert! Rob, 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 Rob! Corporate inspect. My name is Leroy Thompson! Well, have you met Christy? No, I haven't. Hey Christy. Hey. What's with the gloves? Are you sick or something? Oh God, no. If I sick, if I get sick, I'll die. You'll die? Well, on the inside, like emotionally, I mean. Well, it's nice to meet you. Hey, Rob. You sure do know how to pick them.